When a cow gets lost in the field, no one seems to notice. But now a cow lost on a highway, that's a different story. As News Channel 5's Chris Conti found out in Henry County today, the nation is now collectively watching. We're a rural West Tennessee County. Henry County takes great pride in their farming heritage. Uh, and I say there's no call, but we won't take. So you can understand why Sheriff Monty Bilou responded with the utmost urgency Tuesday. And this call is not a strange call to receive at all. You After know. getting word that a baby calf had gotten loose on Highway 79. Uh, this calf was awful stubborn. It would not get out of the roadway. No police academy, though, ever prepared him for a high-speed pursuit on hook. Sometimes have to improvise and adapt and, you know, take care of the situation at hand. And so the sheriff called in backup. I'm, I'm not a very good lassoer. David Bevel is a lifelong friend and a farmer with no horse in sight. Horsepower seemed like the next best thing to get things under control. Uh, he said, what are we going to do? And I said, you're going to get on the hood of my car. And I said, you're crazy. <laughs> we got a calf out in the middle of the lake highway. That's David riding bareback on the front of the sheriff's Crown Vic. Uh, I pulled him up next to it and he made a perfect rope. With one perfectly timed swing. We just roped him. This modern day cattle we wrestling him. duo. We just got him. Wrangled the baby calf got in safely. I'm just thinking, okay, just don't miss. But like 1% is to whole milk, this is only half the story. Two cows had actually gotten loose and they both belonged to Sue's lions. It was the wild west. Suze was driving down Highway 79 when the back of her trailer slid open. And I walked into the bank this morning and everybody was raving about the video. And After a four hour standoff, the second cow was also brought in safely. Great effort on everybody's part. I think we need to, he may need to install a seat belt or something up here on the front. Apparently catching lost calves in Henry County <laughs> doesn't mean waiting until the cows come home. And, uh, hey, who knows what we may do tomorrow. Chris Conti. News Channel 5. Calves were free for a minute. Both of those calves were unharmed. A local vet helped to sedate the second one so it could be brought back home.